Senna. Cows. Okay, the Deadpool and Wolverine trailer is officially here. Let's check this out together. Here we go. Oh. I told you, you're not welcome here. You're not welcome anywhere. Now get out of my bar. Just give me one more drink and then I'll leave. Hi, Peanut. I'm gonna need you to come uh. with me right now. Look, lady, I'm not interested. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I'm sort of on the tick tick, so upsy daisy. Here we go. Oh. Whiskey dick of the claws. <laughs> wow. Green's over 40. You don't want this. <laughs> Unless you want to take a deep breath through your forehead, I suggest you reconsider. <laughs> oh. Oh, well, that's cool with the the Wolverine and I Deadpool cannot believe colors. that this is real, man. I know. I'm about to lose everything that I've ever cared about. Not my problem. Is that what you said when your world went to shit? Come again. This Wolverine let down his entire world. Oh. Oh. Whoa! Ah! Want to talk about what's haunting you, or should we wait for a third act flashback? Uh, go fuck yourself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait, should we wait for a third act flashback? <laughs> it took me a second yeah, to process it. Did it, it. Did it. it, it what did you do? Trust me, oh my Jim, god. I'm hero. You were an X-Man. You were the X-Man. I am soaking wet right now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. Oh my goodness. That action between them looks so good, man. Boys are so silly. This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> Slow motion action. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows if you live or die? Oh my god. Let's fucking go. Yes. Let's fucking go. Yes. Let's go. Oh my god. What? <laughs> <laughs> Wanna do some cocaine? Hey. It's the one thing that Feige said is off limits. What about Bolivian marching powder? They know all the slang terms. They have a list. Even snowboarding? Even disco dust. White girl interrupter? Even horse <laughs> White girl interrupter. Yes. But I can't. <laughs> <laughs> My God. Amazing. They had they had a lot going on in this. Um, the thing that impressed me more than anything was the the fighting. I was just like, this is crazy how good this looks. I'm mean, not that Deadpool had bad action or anything like that in the past, but it's like that looked really, really, really good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, yeah. That, it was shocking. And then uh, like all of the stuff they're integrating from the MCU was also equally surprising just because I'm not used to seeing it with Deadpool. D you know, Deadpool has a surprising amount of heart in each of their films. And that was already present here in the trailer with Wolverine's story. It's like it's going to ride that fine line between farcical and heart. Yeah. You know? I mean, it's it's very, very self-aware. And I absolutely adore that about it. And then Ryan Reynolds just brings himself so well to this character and to this project that I'm like, oh, my God, I'm just so excited for it. It's it looks so good to me. Yeah. And obviously with the pairing of, you know, Hugh Jackman and Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool and Wolverine, I'm just like, yeah, yeah. they they have such great chemistry together. This scene in the op in the bar in the opening of the trailer, yeah. I feel like that's a scene we saw in a Wolverine related video game, Insomniac's Wolverine game, in fact. This scene, this setting of Wolverine at a bar. Not I that feel like we've seen. This reminds me of like the first time I saw Wolverine in X Men. The first time you see Wolverine in X Men at all, he's in the middle of a fight. If he's I in a bar. I just watched it. He's but he's fighting. He's in the middle of fighting, right? Like, um. Well, Rogue comes in. And uh -huh. He's at the bar, and like she gets into some trouble. Okay, I may I might be misremembering. What I remember is Wolverine's in the middle of like some kind of cage match or something, and he's fighting somebody. That's his, that's his reveal. Oh, this exact thing 
this bar, the color palette, him with, you know, like that looks like what I recall from like the Wolverine trailer right here. Look, check this out. Well, this is actually after all the damage has happened, but it's like the bar looks this. It looks like well, the same bar. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. I mean, they, they all kind of look like that. Like every single time he's, he's always in some sort of like. All I'm saying is this exactly. This is where my brain went. As soon as I saw the opening of the trailer, I'm like, oh, it looks just like the game thing that I saw. Anyway, as I said, it's obviously familiar. And we know that the storyline is that, you know, Deadpool is recruited by the TVA, so he's gone back in time to grab Dead uh, to grab Wolverine because yeah. that's the only way that we can have him. <laughs> right. right. I love that we can get him back. That it's gonna be a lot of fun, and they're really, really pushing the line with this like R-rated comedy, mm -hmm. the action as well as the language and the content. And I, I love that bit at the end where he's like, "Yeah, Fe Feige says we can't do this." <laughs> And then they're just like, okay, but well we're going to list all of the ways anyway for shits and giggles. We saw a Doctor Strange po portal thing right near the end. And we had a little Mad Max reference as well and Ant-Man. Yo, what is going on in this movie? This this feels like something out of Mad Max already. Oh, yeah. Like, what? It, what? It's got some kind of solar power thing going on over here with the rocket blasters or Very something. Very eco-friendly. It's an eco-friendly Mad Max. <laughs> yeah, love. <laughs> this new villain that they've introduced, I'm assuming she's a villain. Is she some sort of like alternate universe Professor Xavier? That was the feeling that I got. It, she, it seemed like she was controlling metal. God. Oh, like a Magneto? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. Either it's a Magneto or it's an Xavier female or newborn. I don't know what the heck or, I'm trying to say, but it's, it's like 6 a.m. <laughs> but the thing is, it seemed like it was controlling Wolverine's body. You go back and watch the old X-Men movies, Magneto was like constantly messing up Wolverine for that reason, right? Right, yeah. And I just so, thought she, like maybe she just had the power to just, you know, control people without... With oh, or without maybe. metal in their body. Who is the villain in the new Deadpool movie? Cassandra Nova is the villain in the upcoming... Oh, uh, the evil twin sister of Charles Xavier. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, that vibe was definitely coming through. Emma Corrin is reportedly playing the mysterious character who is the evil twin of Charles Xavier. Nova is a powerful telepath who has a dark history of causing tragedy in the X-Men universe and is known for her hatred of the X-Men. Makes sense. Well, that makes things even more juicy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Juicy and wet. I'm sorry. I can't, like, the the trailer started off, it started it off with, like, a freaking F-bomb yeah. right at the beginning, yeah. which we have obviously censored. Again, I want to, like, t talk about, like, or just mention real quick how much I appreciate how they're introducing Wolverine into this film because... It's not like all hunky-dory from the get-go, which we already knew, but the way in which we're getting that, the execution of it, is very smart, in my opinion, because it's like a lot of character building all over again with Wolverine, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like he's, he's got he's to help him find his, I don't know, that place again where he can be a hero. <laughs> sure, you know? yeah. I feel like that's a constant battle with Wolverine, though. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. He's, one, he's probably the, one of the most emo characters in the X-Men universe. <laughs> but we love him. Yeah, no, for sure. Him and Rogue. Just like, hmm. <laughs> but he's, he was my favorite growing up, and he's, he's probably still my favorite now. You know, it's this, this is a lovely pairing. I'm very excited to watch it, and so can you. All right, you guys. I'm Jabby Koi. This is Achara Kirk. Peace out.